Welcome to Spiritual Rebirth Sanctuary, a safe space for healing with Dr. Madeline. In this meditation, our intention is soul retrieval. Soul fragments break off for protective reasons in this life and in other lifehoods. These soul fragments uh, when returned to our primary soul, aid us a lot in our lifetime. Often trauma in our childhood will cause a soul fracture and fragment. This section of our soul, this fragment, needs to be healed and brought back into our being. An example would be if a parent left early in your lifehood, you might think that you need to protect yourself by increasing your sense of responsibility and independence and releasing and breaking away any of the sense of compassion and feeling like you really need someone and by bringing these soul fragments back into our lives we are able to balance our energies in a new way so let us begin with the soul retrieval in this meditation we utilize the energy of theta healing for this purpose. So let's begin. Breathe in deeply. Exhale slowly. Breathe in deeply into your heart space. Exhale slowly. Release. Breathe in deeply, allowing your body to dissolve into your heart. Exhale slowly, release. With each and every breath, continue breathing into your heart, connecting with the zero point of all that is. In this space, you are nowhere and everywhere at the same time. In this space, the past, present, and future are one in the now. Time does not exist. Your ego dissolves, and your consciousness floats free in your heart's swirling vortex of energy. Keep breathing the breath of life. Good job. As our consciousness is focusing on our heart, as we breathe in and out in the heart space, we begin to allow the light of the heart to grow and grow and grow. It is a beautiful green and pink ball of light that grows larger and larger as it grows and expands, reaching up to the throat, chakra, the third eye, the crown, out into the soul star chakra and above beyond. It moves down into the solar plexus, the sacral, and the base, down into the earth, the earth star chakra, and beyond, into the core of the earth, the grid, the connections. As this ball of light grows and expands and encapsulates your being it pushes from yourself 
all dark energies, discarnate energies, anything that is binding you and keeping you from this process, holding you down, holding you back, releasing the feelings around disbelief, around doubt, with each breath, with each and every breath, releasing doubt and fear, dark energies, discarnate energies, anything that is no longer serving your being in this life time. As you remove these energies, you make space for the new, for the fragments that have broken away from your soul for protection. They were very important when you were a child and thank you, thank them for protecting you by breaking away and protecting themselves and hiding themselves until the time when you are able to free them again. Let us begin to move out with our consciousness around your auric field and to locate the soul fragments. I like to imagine them as little balls of light encapsulated in pockets closed with strings or closed with velcro or closed with zippers and little pockets of safety surrounding you. As this ball of green and pink, pink light expands out around your aura, cleansing your aura, purifying, you are able to identify the cords coming out of your org field out of your body, reaching to each of the soul fragments that are broken away. Everyone is different. At this time, continue to breathe in deeply, breathe out slowly, release. Spend some time connecting with all that is, finding these soul fragments and beginning to bring them toward you. Let's reach out to the youngest fragment. Open its pouch and hold it in your hands a beautiful golden light. Ask the light, are you ready to be healed and to be brought back into the whole, to become part of the balance again? If it says yes, heal it with the energy in your hands and bring it into your soul, in the vortex of your heart. Begin this process again, going to the next fragment that is a little bit older. Bring it, open the pouch and bring it into your hands. Ask it, would you like to be healed and be brought back? And it's okay if it says no and it wants to stay. And it's okay if it wants to be healed. There's no judgment or shame in our lives. And things happen at the right time. 
Feel the soul fragment in your hands. Bring it to a full, pulsating, beautiful ball of golden energy. And bring it into your being. I'm going to hold a space for you with intention. As you continue this process, since each individual has a unique journey in this soul retrieval, Breathe in deeply, release. Feel free to come to this meditation as many times as you need to continue this process of retrieval and healing. You begin to feel the bulk energy of the fragments returning back into your system As you feel them expand and reconnect with your soul's energy, increasing the vitality and balance in your life, hot energy begins to fill your being. All the way from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet, you can feel a warm, hot glow increasing and increasing inside you. You know without a doubt that you have reconnected with yourself, with the parts of you in other lifetimes and in this lifetime that have been pushed away for safety. As you expand your awareness out into the universe, you sense the amazing, absolutely amazing Syrian archangels, your ancestors, your soul family, spirit guides, animals, elementals, they all coming together in community, supporting you and encouraging you in this process, reintroducing and reconnecting every aspect of your being into oneness, into wholeness, into all that is, knowing that you are a hologram in the beautiful tapestry of all that is in the universe and beyond. Your body begins to feel a wealth of well-being. As you focus on this well-being, you can say, I know what it feels like to love unconditionally both myself and others. I know what it feels like to be loved unconditionally, to hold myself high, to walk into a room with confidence and grace, 
I know what it feels like to be whole again, to be one, to be part of the universe, to be part of my soul. Both as I look in and I look out, I feel the oneness and the wholeness around me. I know what it feels like to be brave, to be safe and protected in all situations. I know what it feels like to be love. I know what it feels like to let go of all doubt and fear and worry and dread. I know what it feels like to release all danger for my life and go back into other life modes and heal my heart, heal my soul when I wasn't allowed to shine free. I go back into other lifetimes in my lifetime. To release all martyrdom protocols, now patterns of consciousness. My intention is to bring down those of rainbow energy, light code energy, light code activation, DNA activation. dormant DNA back into existence. I see all this energy into every cell of your body, ground you into Mother Gaia, and raise your vibration to the heavens. This process continues 24 hours a day seven days a week, 365 days a year. And all years and all lifehoods and all timelines and dimensions, in all bodies and energies for your highest good, according to the will of the divine. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It is done, it is done. It is done. Feel free to continue listening to the music for more healing integration of these soul fragments and this soul retrieval in your life. <laughs>